Hello everybody and welcome back to another Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak mod showcase video and today I have a few mods I know some of the older fans will definitely appreciate. While looking through the Nexus I was shocked to see that someone had added Laggy the Lord of the Seas to Sunbreak. A mod author with a fitting name Ivory Lagosrius made this mod and it is a model swap of Royal Luteroth. And the mod states this mod replaces Royal Luteroth using the Lagosrius model and textures from Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate. It's just a reskin, this means that you will be fighting a Royal Luteroth that sounds and looks like a laggy. And the mod author also goes on to say don't blame the Capcom devs for not including Lagosrius in the game. Just because he made this reskin, it just means that the Royal Ludros skeleton would have worked for a Lagosaurus. And if I would have read the description before I started making this video, I would have realized he also made an armor set replacing the Royal Ludroth armor as well as a switch axe. Along with an in-game icon that is just absolutely fabulous, I believe that this mod is super good. You should all go download it, especially if you played Try or 3 Ultimate. Laggy sounds exactly the same. It moves super similar to how it moved before, and I encourage all of you to go download this mod right now. And one notable thing is Ivory Lagosaurus and Abyssal are coming soon, so stay tuned on this mod. And moving on to our next mod, we have the Shapely Minale, and sorry if I got that name wrong, I have no idea how to pronounce it. And the mod states, reshapes Manale to have more shapely body and makes her outfit more showy. And the mod comes with a few different versions, one with no jacket, one with no goggles, and one with no coat and goggles. And these are all off of the base shapely Manali, just her standard outfit, but more revealing. And the mod author is Particular Pommels. They did a wonderful job on this mod for how much time all the players spend at the smithy. And I'm sure it gets hot next to that forge, so this could even be considered a lore-friendly mod. And moving on to our next mod it is the G-Rank Text Replacer. And what it does is it just replaces a lot of the Master Rank Text with the G-Rank Text. And if you played any of the games before, I believe it was World, you would know what G-Rank is. It is basically what Master Rank is, but they replace the G with Master Rank. And I don't even know what the G stands for, but it should stand for OG now. So if you are a new New world elitist please look away and don't leave any hateful comments down below for this next mod but the next mod is no supply items and this mod should be self-explanatory it just removes the supply items from the beginning of the quest i mean with the tent already i mean you shouldn't have any trouble on the quest anyways but back in my day, before you just got supply items on every quest, you would actually have to come prepared for the quest, you know. And in high rank and in G rank, you would usually start in a random location. And even if you did want items back at the base, they usually wouldn't spawn in for like 10, 15, 20 minutes. So this mod's awesome. Thank you, Crystal Shapeshifter, for this awesome mod. And for the final mod of the day, uploaded by Drift Queen Morgana, we have the Lucent Nargakuga Start Screen. And the mod states replaces the start screen with the title update one Lucent Nargakuga key art. And man, is this artwork beautiful. It's a nice change from the Magnamalo Malzeno flash art that we get normally. So I love seeing the tower in the background. I love Lucent Nargakuga and I cannot wait till it comes out. So let me know what you guys think about all these mods. I wanted to give another thanks to all the mod creators. You guys are doing wonderful work and I am hoping to make a video in the future about 
a group of mod or a number of mods that can bring back the old world style of hunting, such as some of the mods I reviewed today, like little things like the G rank text replacer, no supply items, Lagosaurus and whatnot. So let me know what you guys would think about that video and I hope to see you all in the gathering hall. Peace out.